Hi Pisces, this is Sean from Charlie's Angel Tarot and this is your weekly reading for the 28th to the 4th of October 2020 and welcome back, thank you very much for your likes and shares and anyone else that has jumped on this or landed on this page welcome and please subscribe and hit the bell on all and set your settings in YouTube um, so that you'll get notified and also in your mobile device there is a video showing you on how to do that and please like and share as well and remember this is a general reading if it doesn't resonate with you then have a look at your moon sign or your rising sign we start off with the ace of cups and the ace of cups means a new beginning this could be passion, this could be love, a new job perhaps in the healthcare. You can be a nurse, a doctor, a receptionist, anything to do with being of service and uh, or to others and uh, treating people with love and passion and care. Okay, so this could be a new love this is not a love reading this is the general reading for this week the romance readings are out but you can have a look and compare this to your love reading okay your cup is running over in a positive sense i know that water uh, or the the cups represent also emotions no i don't think your cup is running over with tears it's definitely positive now the energy is m much more sensitive as we've just entered Libra and autumn and the May Bon festival season and that means the fall equinox so we've only got three months to go before it's Christmas Wow literally to the day because I'm taping this on the 24th and then it will be Christmas Eve in three months time doesn't time fly I hope you enjoy this month because we've also got two moons one on the 1st of October and the other on the 31st of October and that there will be a blue moon so it is a magical energy so that's why things are positive and your cup is running over now it is also suggesting that you could be meeting a, a Virgo as you have the hermit the hermit represents Virgo but also the hermit represents that it is time to take time out to meditate or contemplate or to take a break and evaluate so that your journey will be lighter and you can carry on on your life's journey as we always gather um, uh, things we don't need and some we have to take time out to let things go to make room to let the new in especially emotionally perhaps you might be in a situation at the moment that you are isolating yourself and doing this to lighten uh, your journey your life's journey you're throwing away the old rubbish that you don't need we always have we always carry our rucksacks uh, our problems our issues our worries our stress with us and we need to meditate and contemplate to take our rucksack and empty it and only take with us the knowledge and the experience that is positive and that we learn from and that we can pass on to third parties if you're not hooked up then you might be meeting a Virgo wow nice one and, and they are exciting people and they are quite lovely uh, every, everybody uh, every uh, person has his negative and his positive side okay so the Virgo is have a look at the Virgo energy video because I did make it last month Virgos can be perfectionists okay but they're, they're an earth sign so they will 
be there and they go for tangible uh, tangibility and uh, durability and long term they are slow and steady but they've got both the feet on the ground lovely okay and they love beauty and then in on Wednesday we have the fortune the wheel of fortune and you might you might be networking you might have met this Virgo or somebody new on the net on internet okay you might of uh, you might have been working uh, on online and you might have met this person and started to talk to them and now you're meeting them because the wheel of fortune also means uh, going up to the next level from uh, working on the web uh, on internet to actually physically meeting them or getting in from going out to getting engaged from getting engaged to get married this could also be a promotion this is also my karma card what goes round comes round what goes up must come down so if you've done good or bad you'll get it back threefold now also with this card you've got the three stooges I call them the three stooges don't listen to gossip this is what I'm hearing there could be uh, gossip going on the internet or on the web uh, in a certain group don't take any notice of that karma will take care of that you could be moving home you could be uh, going on holiday as the wheel of F fortune also means that and we have the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Wands also represents moving home not only that but you will receive news and when you get this news then you must act upon it swiftly directly otherwise this opportunity will pass you by so this could be a promotion or moving home you might even have a, your eye on a house and uh, somebody else beat you to it um, but it could have fallen through so the estate agent might phone you up and said do you still want this house and put in an offer now otherwise it will pass you by okay so there could be a second chance for you that is what I'm feeling if that is what you were looking for or hoping for you've got number 10 so there is an ending a new beginning it's lying next to the ace of cups so this will make you really happy this new beginning news is coming towards you you could be meeting an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius Wow you've got the two of cups you might have uh, partnered up with somebody um, in love or in business as you have union you have found a soulmate let it be in love or in business perhaps this could be that you're buying a business property and you want to, a shop for instance or you might be buying an office where you can uh, work from and create a, a platform a network platform perhaps a dating site you you know things are coming here don't be surprised that things can come out of the cards that I or you don't even know about I mean I don't know there could be somebody out there that we might might be starting up an office or a business to do with internet um, as this is coming through this is being given to me by uh, my guides and angels and you might be partnering up great stuff it has given you uh, sleepless nights don't worry about it give your problems over to the angels and the divine they will they are making things turning right for you they're turning things round like the wheel there's an ending to sleepless nights okay there's a new where there is an ending there's a new beginning because you've got the nine of swords 
you've got the eight of wands so things are going to happen really really fast one after the other or all together and like I said you might be traveling going on holiday this is also a travel card the news will come through cyber and actually cyber is your issue something with cyber big something big is going to happen with you okay this news could come through um, telephone internet like email or text message something that you really want to do something that you can nurture and um, let your passion go into it wow you're going to nurture this love this and you're good at it you'll be nurturing this new crea uh, start you'll be quite busy very busy you might get a lot of clients boom all at once a great big splurt because people have noticed you okay great stuff or you could be meeting you've got the queen of cups you could be meeting um, a Scorpio or it could happen in Scorpio or Virgo time okay now we don't have Libra here you might have started something in Virgo and it's going to bear fruit and it's going to happen quickly in Scorpio time okay but don't uh, exclude uh, Cancer or Pisces in meeting one of these people now you've got the card the answer is maybe the angels acknowledge your question but are unable to give you a definite answer at this time and it's the grey angel feather now maybe you asked a question in Virgo time and the angels are saying we can't give you a, def uh, a definite answer whether it will happen in um, Virgo um, perhaps you might have had sleepless nights in September the beginning of September the end of August and now things are turning round into your advantage uh, as uh, the divine and the angels are hard at work for you to bring it into um, the material world you asked your angels and the angels ask your angels they say ask keep on asking what you want so that we and make it clear so that we can get it done for you don't be like air okay be specific be like the the ones get your answers at the beginning of the week think on it and ask literally I want this I want a shop or I want a space in such a street uh, that is the like if you've got a property uh, in your mind um, visualize it whilst you're meditating or contemplating if you know the address then say I want the house on such and such a street number da 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 and keep on repeating this and um, this is bringing it out into the universe and they will pick it up for you now you have you are climbing up and this is what I'm meaning up to the next step so this card is confirming that one and that one is confirming this you can take that leap of faith but this is not the full but it does look like the full upside down so I don't know why but you're going to get the news you're going moving up you're going to get another perspective definitely you have the path number eight it's also going to bring you've got two eights okay it's going to bring in money big time and very fast now you've got number eight and that is the path so I think you've chosen the right path and it is telling you to stay on the, that path don't worry and ask your angels be specific the way is open for you the path is illuminated because the path is illuminated like the moon card begin your journey now respond and take action yes like I said manifest visualize we must be courageous and move forward you're on the right path you've chosen this path and it is good for you you are emotionally happy it's a new beginning for you it but it takes courage 
and persistence and determination you might be meeting somebody that will support you and will become your partner wow magic okay Pisces I hope you have enjoyed this reading take care and make that maybe a yes because it's in the cards you can do it so long you take action don't let it pass your nose by okay if that's not, that's not don't let it pass you by sorry I'm saying it in uh, wrong English it is well that's because of my whiplash sorry uh, so don't let it pass you by take action when you receive that news there's more news coming okay thank you very much for watching and take care and have a wonderful week please like and share bye bye and be blessed